Hi guys, it's Carissa, and today I'm filming part two of our YouTube shower. If you haven't seen part one, I will make sure to link it below. Unfortunately, I couldn't find a good time for Mike to join me and to get this video up as early as I wanted to, but I had a goal for myself. By the end of the week, I wanted to film this shower and the nursery tour. So depending on how things work out or how long this video is versus that one, you may have already seen the nursery tour. And if that ends up being the case, I will link it below. Also, please forgive me, I am using my new vlogging camera and I'm not used to it yet. So I might, just out of habit, be looking in a different spot like where I used to when I filmed on my iPhone. So if I'm acting weird or looking in the wrong places or if you're seeing just too much definition, like pores and things, um, that's just welcome to my new camera. <laughs> Take this first little package right here. Oh, and this is our baby wet brush. I've heard really good things about these. I actually have an adult version and a mini version that Mike uses to brush Lucy with. <laughs> I think I got it in a subscription box. But this has really gentle nylon bristles, which are supposed to be good for baby hairs. And it is in a cute little pink color. This is from our registry. And that is from Karen. That is from Carrie. Carrie, you're cut off. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is the third thing that she has sent to us. Carrie, you are so sweet and thoughtful, and I will think of you every time I pick up this adorable little brush. Thank you so much. And just like last time, I made sure to pre-cut these so that it would go faster um, and remove addresses when possible. Uh, and hopefully any of them that were sent from the registry have a name associated with them. If not, I will look it up and make sure that I have that information before the video goes live. Oh, I didn't think that we were going to end up with one of these. Um, this is something I registered for. I thought it was so smart. And when I did our final buyout on the registry and used our registry discount, I decided to skip this item. Um... I was like, well, that's probably more of a luxury than anything. But honestly, I'm, I'm thrilled to have this. This is the Grow Egg. And what it is is a very visual thermometer for your nursery. It changes colors based on whether or not the nursery is too cold or too warm or if it's an ideal temperature. And I know that not a lot is known about SIDS, unfortunately, but a spike in a room temperature or a too warm room um, is a risk for SIDS, so that was a concern, obviously. That's always a concern. You can see the little chart here. It tells you if the room's too cold, it turns blue. If it's too hot, it turns red. And the recommended setting has a little smiley face on it, which is so cute. And this is totally unnecessary, but they have little slip covers, so you can make it look like an animal. I may participate in that. Oh, and this is... <laughs> Hi, Carissa and Mike. Bless you both. Congratulations from Tina. Tina just messaged me a couple days ago and said that there was a gift on the way. Thank you so much. That's so thoughtful. We're going to get so much use out of that and a lot of peace of mind. So thank you. This is from Sarah, who, if you don't remember, in one of our baby gifts videos, sent us a giant box of gifts. Um, just so many clothes and really thoughtful items, a stuffed animal. Um, some bath salts for me and a um, really beautiful print that was framed. She sent us so much stuff and yet insists on sending another box. And here's the inside. Oh my gosh. No. Oh, this is so awesome. I was going to look into getting something like this, but I was overwhelmed by it. There's so many out there. This is a projector. This is the Aurora Borealis Night Mood Projector. Recreates the Aurora Borealis lights on your ceiling. Eight, enchanting illumination modes to suit any mood you desire. Automatic shut off after one hour. Oh, and it can play music from a Bluetooth speaker. And there it is, look at that. It's really cute too. Even not in action. What a cool thing to have. Thank you so much, Sarah. Mike's going to be pretty excited about that, too. Oh! <laughs> oh, I've seen these books before. I don't know that I've seen this one specifically. So, so she sent a book for us, a baby-related book for us last time. She sent us Go the F to Sleep, um, which is very popular. And now I have this handy little guy. <laughs> this is so funny. And I know that this is a joke, but I genuinely think that this is a lot of how Mike is going to be 
um, a lot of these things which makes it even funnier to me on a different level. She wrote, in a couple of months, this is going to be so much more funny and so real. Oh, I'm going to enjoy this so much. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> and she's good. She's good with clothes. She, she really knows how to find them. Look at this. Hello World in gold glitter with heart glitter elbow patches. Does this go with it? Oh my gosh. Look at these pants. Oh, and a little sassy headband. It goes with her nursery. <laughs> These are very, this is, this hoodie embodies her nursery completely. This is beautiful mint floral pattern with white and gray stripes and a pink hood. And look at the pants. So, so cute. I love the stripes. And I'm sorry, I'm filming this at like 5.30 at night, so it is so dark out and the lighting is terrible. I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look, she knows me. She knows my style. I, I love blue and I love the floral. Look at the inside of the hood has floral and the pocket and these pants. The little blue cuffs at the bottom. And a Lucy. A Lucy. Huh, Lucy? Oh, she says, where's my dinner? It's too early, Lucy. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, look at this. We actually received one of these from a friend, but it's different. This is actually a different size, and it has a felt belly. This is a Totoro onesie. Look at it. Yeah, this is different. It's very similar to the other one, but now she has one in different sizes, so she can wear more Totoro even longer. And it came with a little hat and earrings that I can't show you yet. Can I show you? I don't know. Oh my gosh, they're little crystal initial earrings. And they're her initials. Because Sarah was one of those lucky people who got to find out her name in the like three days that we were telling people before we decided to stop telling people. Oh my gosh. Oh, these are so beautiful. Oh, Sarah. Thank you so much. I thought I'd send something that is a shared interest of ours for Baby G. Hedgehogs. So happy for you guys. Can't wait to meet her. Jacqueline from Toronto. Oh my gosh. Okay. These are so cute. And it's 24 months, which is awesome because we don't have as much stuff in that size. So hopefully she'll get to wear. Oh, this is so nice. Look. Oh my gosh, you guys. There's a little lace trim at the bottom and a floral hedgehog on the front. You guys know I love little girly hedgehog things. It's so like thick and nice too. Oh, look, it's a full, it's a full bodysuit. It was all folded up. Oh, that is so nice. <gasps> Thank you. And this is easily one of the cutest things I've ever seen. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, they're little corduroy pants. <laughs> they're like cream colored corduroy pants with hedgehogs all over them. Oh, look at those. They're so cute. Oh, they're so soft. Jacqueline, that was so thoughtful and amazing. Thank you so much. Oh, this is from my friend Megan from Australia. And she sent a birth announcement with her sweet little baby boy in it. Oh my gosh. Oh, you guys. Oh, I gasped so many times in my last hour. I'm try trying to really refrain from doing that, but this is gasp worthy. Look at these boys. <laughs> so precious. Look at these booties. They're so pretty. They're, they've got like a pearl flower with a little clasp. And they are, I don't know if you can tell, but they are pink, blue, and purple. And white. Oh, and they're handmade. They're so beautiful. Thank you so much. And Lucy is, Lucy wants to chew these, so I have to put these up. <laughs> they're so beautiful. Oh, oh my gosh. Hold it together, Carissa. It's so tiny and sweet. Loose. No, I'm sorry, Loose. <laughs> Look at that little sweater. First of all, this is this looks like something I would wear. <laughs> which is part of why I like it so much. It's so beautiful. Oh, you sent us a sweet little newborn outfit already. And I just I absolutely treasure these things. They're so beautiful. Look at these. Look at these sweet little booties. They have like forget-me-nots or... Is that what the little blue flowers are on the front? My grandmother would have loved these. 
she would have absolutely loved this oh thank you so much oh this i got to pick out this is an engraved signature disc necklace from stella and dot and this was offered to me by kimberly very very sweet and generously i am going to link her stella and dot page below so you can have custom engraving done and depending on the shape of the piece there's different types of engraving i went with a classic monogram um, and this does have our little girl's initials on it. Oh, it's so beautiful in person. I typically need necklace extensions, so I don't know if it will fit me right now. Especially because I like to wear my necklaces a little bit lower, but look how beautiful that is. And if you know someone who is a new mom or a recent bride, um, or even just someone who really likes a classic look or a classic style. They do have really modern like bar necklaces as well that I looked at. Um, their stuff is just beautiful. So please shop her link. I'll post it below. Um, she's very good and responsive if you have questions. And I think that this is just absolutely stunning. Oh, thank you so much, Kimberly. I am going to wear the heck out of that. Oh my gosh, look at this card. This is from Haley from South Carolina. <laughs> she wrote, I wish Mike was here. She wrote, congrats, y'all. Oh, that really threw him off last time. She said this is her first attempt at a baby blanket. This is, this is perfect. I can't believe this is the first time you did this. It's like the perfect weight. It's so soft. I am so in love with this. Thank you so much for taking the time to do that for us. Oh. <laughs> And she sent us the book, Hedgehogs. I haven't read this one yet, but I did really want it. It is a sleeper, which we didn't have enough in size three to six months. This is a size three, so that's awesome. That's one less sleeper I have to buy. Um, and look at the cup. This is like, this is so me. It's a zip one, so that's going to be really handy. Can you see the little pattern on it? It's like a winter scene with deer and trees and a snowman. I haven't seen this before. Oh, Carter's is just the greatest, aren't they? And Haley, I, I know you've watched this for a really long time and this was just such a nice surprise. Thank you so much. Oh, this is so exciting. This is from our registry. Oh, it's so cute. It's way nicer in person too than I would have expected. I was expecting a little tiny thing. Who is this from? <gasps> Tina! This is from Tina also. Oh my gosh. This is a Hello Kitty book. A baby book. It's like a baby paper crinkle book. Oh, I'm so excited about this. Lucy's also a little excited about it. Luce, say thank you, Tina. Oh my gosh. Oh, this box. Somebody overdid it. Okay, this is from Sarah. Look at this adorable card. First of all, there is a little bag of accessories here that I'm just dying over. These are my favorite, are the little headbands with the teeny bows. They're just very tasteful to me, I think. Here's mint, which you guys know I need. I'll get a lot of use out of that. Oh my gosh, did you make these? Look at that. Oh, they're beautiful. Lucy, I don't know if you can see Lucy is, she's eyeballing these. Look at these shoes. Are these cats? Look at these little shoes. <laughs> oh, those are too cute. Here's a little pair of mittens. And here's some newborn onesies. Look at these. There's pink with a little uh, animal print. And a bunch of little animals like at a park. <laughs> and green and white polka dot. And this almost looks like twall, but it's like, it's like the animals at the park scene, but it's just a very delicate pink. Look! Oh, this is so exciting! Here is that awesome hedgehog onesie, but in zero to three months. Right, zero to three, yes! So she can wear one right away. And then when she's two, or maybe a little before then, she can wear the other one. Oh, my niece would have loved this when she was little. It's a little pink elephant with a little flower. And it's like a little mini crinkle flat book. Oh, there's a mirror. No. Oh, that is happening. And it's light blue. And two books, the going to bed book. And I love you night and day. 
Now she said this one is a favorite in her home and I've actually seen it before but I've never read it. And this book is amazing. I did read this one before. This I really love this book. Sarah, that was so awesome. That was so awesome. Thank you so much. Oh, look at this. I have a wrapped gift and very exciting book that I'm already <laughs> so thrilled to see. Every time I think about you meeting your daughter, I get choked up. You deserve all the happiness coming your way. I'm just so happy for you. Congrats, Mama. All your dreams are almost here. And that's from Sam. <laughs> <sighs> Sam's another one that's been, been been around for a long time and I appreciate her friendship so much. Wait, I know I mentioned to you guys in one of my videos how much I love these books and I threw a few of them on my registry mainly just so that I could go back and buy them slowly over time. These are those really nice flat books that I've mentioned to you guys and this is Babies Love Opposites and Babies Love Halloween! Yay! And look at this beautiful wrapped gift here. <laughs> I swear, I'm like a raccoon. I'm so mesmerized by these bags. Oh, <laughs> and inside this is babies love things that go. Look how cute. Oh, thank you, Sam. So I don't know if this is part of Sam's or if this is part of a different one or separate entirely. I just tried looking at my thank you list from my phone and it's not really cooperating. Um, but I just happened to open another smaller box and it had this book inside of it. Babies Love Christmas. Oh, it's so cute. I will find out who that's from. Thank you so much. We almost have all of them now. <laughs> okay, here is a box that was wrapped in brown paper and I unwrapped it to protect the address. And this is from, and I'm so sorry, I don't, I'm not sure how to pronounce your name, um, so please let me know. Um, I don't know if it's Jenna or Gina. So first is a little Huggies case, like a travel case, and it has cloth wipes in it. Like white, oh look, and they're even folded so that they'll, so I can pull them through the slot. And, the, and it'll advance the next one. I'm not sure if I'm going to even have time to upload it, but I had purchased some cloth wipes, so I'm excited about this because I'm hoping to use them, like all the time, as much as possible. Next, there is a Huggies wipe dispenser. Oh, and there is a roll of disposable um, uh, liners for cloth diapers in there. That's actually a really good idea. I would not have thought to do, I have, I have a roll of this somewhere too that I can just plop in here when I've used those up. That's really smart. Here is another one. Oops, popped open. This one's full of cloth wipes. Look at that. They're so nice too. How cool is that? Oh my gosh, thank you. You have totally encouraged me to move forward with my cloth wipe plans. Hopefully I can get that video up so you guys can see the ones that I picked out. Stop, shut up, look at this. It's a big wet bag, look at that. Smart Bottoms wet bag. It's got cute little animals all over it. Oh, look at this one. It's got dachshunds all over it, so that's really cool. Look, and it's got double, oops, it's got uh, double hanging straps. I actually set my other one up only has one strap, but I set it up with two hooks because I know that a lot of wet bags have two hooks or I figured I could just hang something else next to it if I needed to. Look, and it's a really good size also. Those are going to get a lot of use. Thank you so, so, so much. What a thoughtful gift. That's really awesome. Thank you. And speaking of dogs, here is the Christmas Shih Tzu. <laughs> Hi, Bows. He was at work with Daddy. Oh, I know who this is from. This is from Diana. Um, you guys know, know her as Baby for Di. And she has two amazing twin girls. And she recommended this to me. And when I told her that I hadn't heard of it and I was really excited about it, she actually said she wanted to just send me one. Which I thought was so, so sweet of her and so generous. Mike's really excited about this too. Um, this is a seat for bath time. It has little storage pockets on it. But most importantly, it keeps you from having to blow your knees out and your back 
bending over the tub from on the floor. And it folds up really flat, so I can set it right next to my sink. And that's gonna be awesome. Is it weird that I love that it's blue too? <laughs> this is gonna be so nice to have. Thank you so, so much. I discovered your channel shortly after you got pregnant and I'm so glad I did. So happy for you both and I cannot wait to see our little girls. And that's from Casey, Case and Lou on YouTube. Her shower is next, it's coming up, so I'll, I'll link her channel if you guys aren't familiar um, or if you want a reminder to check out her shower. I think she's either filming it or posting it on the 13th of this month. And she's expecting a little girl named Penny. Oh, I just lost my earring. So there are a couple of books in here. Here is another copy of Hedgehogs. Oh, and the snowy day. This is, you have to have a copy of this, right? Oh, I haven't read this since I was a kid. I'm really looking forward to rereading it. I always loved this though. So. Oh, yay, and our alphabet placemat. I registered for this. I know it's, you know, it's gonna be a while before she will use it, but I just can't resist. I think placemats are very important, and I also think that it's so bright and colorful, and there's so much that can be learned from it, um, aside from just colors and the animals and the objects and the alphabet. I just, I feel like this is a really good thing to have. So thank you so much for that. I can't wait for your shower. This is from Fee. Um, she had a channel of Fee, I think TTC and me. I'll link it below. Here is the first 100 words book. I have admired this book. Oh yes, this is gonna be great. Thank you. <gasps> oh look, it's a little lovey. It's called Petals the Hedgehog. And she's got little tags on her back. And it's so colorful in different fabrics. And look at all the tags. Ooh, and it's satiny underneath. I've never seen this. Look how sweet her little face is. Oh, what an amazing find. Thank you for thinking of me. I love that. Look, it's a little hedgehog in a pocket. I don't know if you guys can see. She's sparkly and she's smiling. It's a little pink striped shirt. It's got cuffed button detail on the sleeves. And here's the little pants. I love navy with white polka dots with the light pink. It's just such a good combination. That is adorable. Thank you so much, V. Oh my gosh, thank you. And last but not least, oh, this is a big one. Oh, look, oh. Oh my gosh, this one's packed. And it doesn't say who it's from. I, If I had to guess, this might be from Cindy because I'm pretty sure she said something was on its way. Oh, bummer, maybe the Christmas book went with this too, I'm not sure. Okay, I'll, I'll confirm that for you guys. Right on top here is a sleep sack. I was definitely wanting to get more of these, so I'm glad to have another one. I feel like, I don't know, just one more helps a lot, actually. And this is the birth to six month size, and it's this pretty wavy um, color pattern, see, right there that thank you so much in this book the little yellow bee i love bees bumblebees these i thought were so cute i feel like i really would have liked these when i was little these are bath toys these are float and play bubbles and it's four different ones and they have they each have a different color ring on them and then a little oh, can you see a little turtle on the inside of there and this one has a penguin, and then there's a spinner in the bottom one. These are so much fun. Thank you so much. This is a VTech toy. It has a suction base, and it's like a little Ferris wheel. Is that what that's called? Ferris wheel. Oh, it moves on its own. So it plays music, and it is interactive. It talks. The little animals spin, and there's beads and lights and colors. So I think it's so great to have this. Thank you. This is so generous thank you guys so much just to think that you guys you know you could be strangers and i know in a way you are still but you're you're not also at the same time you're a huge part of our story and our journey and you've become friends and just it's it's at the time of filming this i am 36 weeks and three days and we are getting more and more excited by the minute um, for her arrival. We are hoping it's sooner than later, but we'll accept her anytime she gets here. Um, we just want her to have a safe and healthy entrance into this world. And we can't wait to share 
her with you guys and um and just our lives we we're just so thank you from the bottom of my heart I know Mike is so grateful also and he is gonna just he's gonna die when he sees all this stuff um I just I'm gonna really enjoy sharing it all with him and um and with our little girl when she gets here so thank you thank you and uh I'll talk to you guys very soon bye